students, parents, staff, and community leaders across Greenville County put on their walking shoes to participate in International Walk to School Day. They joined more than 300 schools across South Carolina and many others around the world to participate in this annual event. Duncan Chapel Elementary hosted a parade from the public's parking lot at University Square to the school. The event included the Traveler's Rest High School Marching Band, Berman University Cheerleaders, Watch a school day! and hundreds of parents, students, and staff. Rodney Oldham, Safe Routes to School Program Coordinator for South Carolina, was on hand for the parade and to announce that Duncan Chapel Elementary was one of only five schools in the state to receive a $400,000 Safe Routes to School Infrastructure Grant. Duncan Chapel was one of the uh, five schools that uh, we announced that received a $400,000 infrastructure improvement grant here to uh, help to improve some of the sidewalks, uh, pedestrian uh, signage, as well as the safety here around the school. We, we looked at the basic needs, we looked at our crash test data, we looked at the infrastructure as it was as a whole, and we also graded the uh, various um, grant applications that came in on the scoring system here. And Duncan Chapel, we felt, was one of the schools here that was most deserving to receive the uh, grant. And it looks like they uh, could benefit from uh, having these funds here to help out with the school, to help to improve the infrastructure, and just make it a little bit more safety for the kids to walk and bike to school. The school's PTA spearheaded the campaign to apply for the grant. Bob Whitehead, who serves on the PTA board, explained that they wanted to do something to improve the safety of students and staff. Uh, one of the things is putting more crosswalks around uh, for the students to cross back and forth. Working on the sidewalks, uh, there's actually a big ditch in front of the school that's going to be filled in and be worked on as well. We're actually going to extend the sidewalk going up to the main road, uh, Old Buncombe. Um, and in affiliation with Furman and the Swamp Rabbit coordinators uh, is actually going to be a walk-in that attaches to that and so actually the new communities that are being built down by Furman will be able to have a safer route to get to the local school and so all this is about making it safe but also giving the children a healthier way to get to school whether through biking or walking um, and also be able to help around the school make it look pretty and also for the community make it safer we want the community to be a part of the school as well use our track use our playground um, and so more stop signs, uh, numerous things that we touched on is, is what we're looking at getting out of this grant.